Hey, what are on earth? You're up and it's jumped out already. Chemistry. Okay, we get it. You got chemistry. What are on earth? <laughs> Come on. Very soon. Separation. So much you guys want to say to me. Yeah, like, I'm separated. Give me them back very soon. Religious factors. Attraction. How do I attract them in? You know, this is my spiritual path. This is what I'm meant to do. But I'm in separation. Let's start again. Hi, water and earth. How are you doing? This is the read I promised from the poll. Water and earth here. Let's see the energy between water and earth, guys. Let's see. I've put all those cards back. So let's see. Finances and career and true love. So you could be more focused on career at the moment than your true love. Okay, so make the effort, true love. Great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take. Forgiving and learning between you guys. So a lot of learning going on and a lot of forgiveness needed probably here. So let's see. It's probably taught you a lot, this relation. True love. Okay, I get it. What on earth? You guys love each other. This is a romance of a lifetime. It's taught you everything. I get it. What on earth? Come on. True love. I get it. Stop throwing them. Trust. This situation is calling for you to have faith. Okay, so that's why we're seeing the religious factors there, probably a spiritual awakening and you're having to trust in divine timing, trust yourself, your um, instincts, your, you know, that high priestess, you've got to trust her, trust that you know what's meant to be separation. Okay, so you wanted me to know again, you're in separation, time apart from your partner is on the horizon here. I don't know why I just feel like let's get one more here. So you're separated from your true love here. Trust the divine. Trust the divine. Let me turn it over. Giving your relationship a chance. What jumped out was honeymoon. Wanting to spend time together to work it out. So you feel like, you know, if you just have, you know, a chance to be together in peace away from everything else, that you two could work this out here. Okay. So let's see. I'll be using the mythical tarot deck now. So you want, you're in separation, but you want to work it out here. This is your true love. It's calling for you to have faith. You just want some time together. Maybe the other person is at a distance from you here with this honeymoon card. Two of swords. So um, they're indecisive about coming towards you here, guys. Okay. Indecision is holding them back. They feel like um, they don't know how they'll be perceived, um, you know, what they have to say, how it will be taken. Um, but so I feel like they're a bit sheepish in coming forward here. OK, they're a little bit scared. So indecision is holding them back, not knowing what's going on with you. Um, but they've got to trust their instincts as well to come forward here. So let's see. Page of Swords. They're choosing to spy on you rather than speak to you and come forward. So, yeah, more information is needed. That's because here, look, we have a blindfold. So they feel like they need more information before coming forward. So they're choosing to spy on you, which I think like it's showing up as a page. It, you know, it represents like immature behavior, like come on you know um step forward and speak ask questions if you want to find out some information because when we look on people's profiles and social medias it might just give a totally different picture to what's really going on with them i mean have you seen pictures like this on people's facebook and really they're in separation you know or they you know they they post pictures like look we're on holiday and you're watching it, but 
you know, you're not having all the information. So I feel like you, they could be gathering in false information here as well. Because they, they could be looking on social media rather than, you know, because I was going to say pride. So I feel like it's pride that's holding them back then here. They're feeling the loss. They're feeling the loss now in this separation. So they're starting to spy on you. Okay, five of pentacles. They're feeling the lack now. Look at this guy in the separation card. He's holding, you know, um, his hand over his heart. He's feeling this now in his heart chakra. That's what we'll go through through the um, awakening here. So feeling the lack has got them spying on you. It's holding them back because they feel like they don't, they don't know what's going on with you. They haven't communicated. They're just spying. So it just makes them feel worse. I feel like they're jumping to conclusions. Oh, they're in a relationship. Nine of pentacles, but you're single. You're single. You're on your own. You're not accepting offers. You're quite happy. This will land on giving the relationship a chance. So you're quite happy to give this relationship a chance. You just need them to come forward and speak rather than spy. Um, you know, maybe explain why they left you out in the cold. And, you know, now they're feeling left out in the cold. But I feel like you're feeling a bit more positive here since as as you're coming up you may have gained your confidence back here um with the nine of pentacles but you still are open to giving this relationship a chance here guardian yeah you've been learning to love yourself learning to take care of yourself here um Sorry, my nose tickles when I read. Um, so, yeah, you've been learning to take care of yourself. The Guardian, this card is. Um, and they're now starting to go through it. They're now starting to feel the effects of being apart from you. Whereas I feel you've gained growth in this situation. And they're watching you grow here, okay? They're watching you grow and they're starting to feel like they're not good enough, okay? Um, so then they have to grow. It doesn't mean like you go tell them, oh, you are good enough for me because if you've truly grown um, and they are still in page mode, then they are not um, to be with you. But here I feel like, not that they're not to be with you, they're to grow, okay? To get to this nine of pentacles, you're regaining your confidence here. You've been here, five of pentacles. You've been there. You know, I feel probably when the first separation happened, you was the one feeling left out in the cold. But now, shoes on the other foot, the tables have turned here. You're starting to look after yourself and protect your energy with the Guardian. Eight of Pentacles, like I said, you're working on yourself. Now this has to kick in for them. They have to realise you know, work doesn't always have to be like a miserable thing to do. It, you can enjoy this. You can enjoy learning. You can enjoy growing. Um, if you know that at the end, you know, there's so much abundance that can come in this relationship, so much abundance that can come in life. So, again, I feel like maybe they might be um, their money. They might have money problems. Um, so they're working hard they're trying to focus on work i think we've seen that as well finances and career um so they're just working because they're struggling um money wise as well um if you're struggling money wise here um you need to focus on that at the moment okay um don't focus on spying them it'll bring a blockage in the way so i feel like at the moment they are struggling for money and they're focused at work they're not taking any action towards you um they're spying on you they're watching you it's like that um sting song um 
every move you make, every step you take, I'll be watching you. Um, the King of Swords here as well. So let me just finish this. Yeah, so the King of Swords. So um, they need to be more logical. They need to come forward in a King energy. They need to speak to you and clarify things. The, um, I feel like a conversation needs to happen here. They're trying to get information from somebody else about you. Why are they trying to get information about an air sign? So it, maybe if you have a sister or a brother that's an air sign, they're talking to somebody you know and asking for information about you if you're dating. Like, are they dating? Are they working? Are they doing okay? What's going on with them? Maybe even if you have children with this person, it could be that they're talking and asking questions here like, what are they doing? They try, they go into somebody else here to ask for information because um, they're indecisive whether to come forward, whether to take action. So I feel like they're still being quite cold towards you because they're not communicating with you. They're communicating with somebody else about you. They're talking with somebody about you, um, you know, and I think that what the other person is saying is, oh, they're doing fantastic. So they're seeing this nine of pentacles image of you like, oh, you're doing great. And I feel like I'm feeling the loss. Are they not feeling the loss of me? So maybe say in the beginning of the breakup, you was feeling like the five of pentacles out in the cold and they was like, and you was questioning, um, I'm just trying to get you to remember the five of pentacles energy, um, you know, was how are they doing without me? Are they not feeling it? So they're asking those questions to themselves here. Uh, so that's caused them to spy on you uh, and ask questions. They're seeking um, help from somebody else here with this King of Swords. And somebody is talking to them. This King of Swords is somebody is talking to them about you. Queen of Pentacles. Here we are, Earth signs. So is it you, Earth signs, who are, you know, spying? <laughs> This speaks of taking care of yourself, needing to ground your energy, okay? Um, by this, say, I'm thankful for what I have. Um, and it can also say, you know, if you are struggling with money, um, working hard and career will be your focus at this moment. So maybe you're just working hard and working on yourself here as well, nurturing yourself, and they're asking questions about you here. So you could be, even if you're water, you could be in this Queen of Pentacles energy, focused on your coins, focused on money here, and their focus is on you. Okay? The message is for the watcher of the video. Their focus is on you, and your focus is on grounding yourself, getting your money right, nurturing yourself. Maybe you're even going to the gym and keeping fit right now. You may, like, start putting... Now we're in Leo season, you may start putting energy into your appearance here, okay? Maybe eating better, like I'm on this spiritual path, you may have started eating different with the Queen of Pentacles. So all this is accumulating to, um, you know, this Nine of Pentacles energy, you feeling confident, feeling good. It's like, you've got this, okay? You know, taking care of yourself with the guardian, loving all parts of yourself and nurturing all parts of yourself um, is what's best for you right now, okay? Um, they're taking notice of you. They're taking notice of you. This page is staring me down. Um, they could be talking to people about you. They're definitely feeling the lack without you. They feel like you're moving on and you're improving without them. Um, but this is for them to feel. they they got to get in their feelings here so that they can then take the action to grow. They're in their feelings here, I'm telling you right now. They're, I feel like they're the one that left you, but they're the one feeling left behind now, okay? This is what I'm just touching this card is making me feel like they feel like they was left behind. So it's just really feeling the loss.
they feeling like you're growing and succeed they can see it they know it somebody's telling them this i'm telling you somebody's telling them this empress now they're like okay they've got so much abundance going to them and i'm feeling the lack not that this is like oh this is so much money annoying when spirit tickles your nose why does it do it um so this is like you you're growing so much right now so be careful careful when jupiter goes direct because i gain weight if i'm not active and i'm not focused on money and things like that being a scorpio i gain weight with jupiter and that can happen um so you know this is your money and your career um wanting to expand so where you put your focus will expand okay so if you're focused on money it will expand if you if you are focused on growth it will like your growth will expand this is giving birth to something new here you could even get pregnant um so it's up to you congratulations i'll be careful <laughs> but yeah this is like um abundance coming in for you now um focusing on you is really paying off for you okay good things will come your way and so will this person when the time is right they've got growing to do they've got growing to do because they're in a page energy and you're an empress energy okay if if you feel like you're the one feeling lack and you're the one spying um redirect your focus onto yourself um and onto work here um if you're finding yourself um looking at their facebook or whatever i would say give yourself a break from social media during this time your emotions are going to be heightened it's going to make you feel worse so you'll start to feel that five of pentacles lack energy again so please 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 take your focus away from that you're splitting your energy so what you're doing is um say you want to focus on your money but you're focused on your heartache let's say or you're focused on getting information about somebody that um you're, you'll end up feeling this five of pentacle because it's going to be um, magnified here, um, especially the further we go into August. OK, you want to start moving into that confident energy because, um, you know, it'll just bring in more good stuff for you here. You need to use this King of Swords energy to cut off um, that feeling of lack. So if you're honest with yourself and you're the one who's spying, um and you're feeling like they're moving on without you and you're feeling left behind it's not the case okay you're not left behind they're not left behind it's just perception here we need the hangman so we can gain new perspective have some time out to yourself focus on yourself there um nine is hermit mode so you might need to go into hermit mode if you're the one who's spying on them okay but this speaks of an abundant new beginning happening here guys something's about to give birth with this egg here and they see you as the ideal candidate they're looking at you through some rose tinted glasses at the moment like you can do no wrong like i said it feels like they left you but they're now feeling like you left them behind or something guys good luck guys good luck <laughs> 